Howdy hey. Gold Rush 21. My birthday, it's official. I'm 56. But, it's time to open my present. I held off, I behaved. I told myself I wasn't going to peek until Sunday. Today's Sunday. Two days worth of digging. Okay, I didn't dig all day, but ran some good dirt. Um, I still got to uh, take my little kitchen screen here and classify the, the rocks out of this. And then uh, I set up my keen to, uh, like I did the other week, to the cleanup setting. And I'm uh, going to try that. I'm going to feed it into a bucket. Because I'm still learning, uh, I'm probably going to run it a couple times. And uh, the normal mat that's in here, let me move this. As you can see, is uh, much uh, more aggressive matting. It does really well, actually, and simple to clean out. Um, I love it. I love it. It's, it's just awesome. But, uh, yeah, so we're going to get this going. We're going to see if my birthday weekend dig was successful. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey. Okay. Took my screen there. Got everything classified down. That's a lot of, a lot of pay dirt. Then uh, I dumped the gravels into here. And then once I, I'm actually going to pan those too uh, in this giant pan just in case uh, any of the gold stuck to these or something, you know, or there might be a big old nug. But, uh, yeah, I hope this clean-out thing works. It will really save me some time and get uh, all of this, hopefully, down to maybe a cup or so. So, uh, going to have to play with it a little bit because I haven't done this clean-up process this way. But uh, it looks nice and level. Uh, I can adjust the flow, which I'm going to do a little bit right now, because I can always turn it up. But it uh, looks like i got to raise this up just a tiny bit, and uh, because you don't want too much pitch, but you also can adjust the water. So technically, I could probably run this almost flat and just turn the water up. But I want those ripples, and it's better to explain on this one, to create the little vacuum and get the get the lighter material out, but hang on to those nugs. So, we'll play with it a little bit, and we'll see how it works. Gold Rush 21. Birthday dig. Okay, so looks be working good. Uh, this is just basically to mix it up and get it down. This is the true clean out area, but seems to be working pretty darn good. It's holding on to the black sands. I have so much of them, uh, more than well twice of what I normally am cleaning out. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish running this this bucket. And uh, I'll clean it out into a clean bucket and then do it again. But uh, again, I have a lot more black sand than I thought I was going to. There's a lot in there. Huh. That might be a good sign. The gold hangs with that. So, I'm going to keep it going. We'll see how the first clean out looks when I shut her down. Gold Rush 21. back okay well got that those concentrates done um, I know I got gold because I could see it in the shovel fools and those ripples are just packed so I'm definitely gonna have to run definitely gonna have to run this more than once oh look at that 
Just walk over here and there's gold right there. There's gold all throughout that. So yeah, I think I have the water running a little hot because I see a flake down here too. But plus these riffles are just, just packed. Look at that piece right there. Oh, that might even be a nug. Let's see if that's a picker. I don't know. I don't even know if that's gold. Guess we're going to find out. But there's lots of gold in there, and I'm sure I blew some out. So what I'm going to do is clean this out, get it into a pan, get my gold wheel fired off, get this running in the wheel while I run this again. And then uh, just keep that process up. Right now there's so much black sand that uh, I'm sure those riffles just got so full so fast that... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I, I'm sure I blew gold out, but that's why I'm feeding it into a bucket. So, go find me some nugs and my birthday pay dirt. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey. Back at it. Just an update. Okay, I got uh, I got that all cleaned up for the first time. Going to rerun these again, but I took the first clean out. Move that a little bit. Took the first clean out. And I got my gold wheel running. So I'm going to take that, run it through that while that's still going. So uh, I know there's gold in here because I saw it. But so this takes a lot more time. It, it basically, I have to have it set right now. I'm not quite getting it as high as I want it to. I can turn it down a little bit. But the gold's going to fall in that cup. Hopefully that cup's going to be full. Actually, I'm just going to leave that be for right now. But, I'm ready to open my birthday dig Christmas, Christmas present. Birthday present. It's going to be a nug. I know it. Old Rush 21. Okay, howdy hey. All right. Well, I just finished running my third time through, and you can still see lots of, lots of black sand. But again, and I see gold, there's a flake there, there's a flake there. So, that means I'm going to do it again. Um, I think what I'm trying to do here is... Uh, should I pan or use this? But I also remember that you normally clean out every day. This is two days, two days of material. And this isn't hard. It just, uh, see like there's some small flakes right there. There's a nice one there. So I'm getting less and less black sand each time, which is good. So I'm just going to just keep Doing the clean out here, taking it to the gold wheel in there, run it in there, and and uh, until basically that black sand is gone. I'm just going to keep running it and running it, and and uh, but it is almost time to get a hydration. Uh, but uh, yeah, it gives me something to do. It's a beautiful day to be 56 years old. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey, back to my birthday gold rush cleanup. I uh, have to point out my lucky gold that Rich and I found one time. There actually was a flake in there. But uh, that concentrates almost done on the first run. Just wanted to point out. That's right, people. Them never nugs. But I'm letting, I slowed down the water on my keen a little bit. Um, fed it a little bit slower again everything everything you do when you're learning this crap not crap stuff um, is a learning curve so I really wanted to learn how to use this because it is a tool it was part of the reason why I bought it and it seems to be working so 
I see people that buy, you know, special cleanup sluices and all that stuff. I love that cold wheel, but uh, let's set the water off and we'll see if we got any more gold in there. Let's take a look. Oh, I see a few flakes. A lot of it's going to be buried in these seams. But the only way we're going to know is clean it up. Yeah, there's a few flakes in there. Not as many as the first, but the good news is I don't really see... Oh, there's one right there. So that means I'm still blowing out a little bit. And it's just probably... There's a piece there. Um, it's probably mostly because, again, it's just so much black sand. It's filling up these riffles and uh, probably washing it out. But that's the fun of it. Gold Rush 21. Let's keep them feeding. Hey, hey, basically, just wanted to show you how simple it is to clean this sluice out. Uh, what I do is I just pull it over, pull this mat out carefully, just let it go in the bucket. Have to lift this up, roll this up. Put it in the bucket. Then, what I do is to flush it out, run it a little bit, just until the water gets enough to clean off those mats. It's done. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey. Back again. Still at it. Uh, just ran again. And as you can see, way, way less black sand than there was. Right now I shut it off. I'm trying to see if I even see any gold right now. Uh, there's a micro dot right there. A micro dot there. Some right there, right there. Let's take a look here. Really, the ones I'm seeing are really, really small, but we're gonna stay on it. Uh, that's just what I want to do anyway. But I'm just taking it from there, bringing it over here, and run it in here, and just a quick sneak peek. I don't know if you can see that. But there's gold in there. So we know we got gold. Still on the fence about that. I don't know. On the other hand, you know, when I used it last time, I was messing up because I was being so impatient and I was losing gold by panning too. So at least this way it's contained. It's, uh, I can run it as many times as I want. And it is proven to me, because, you know, if you look at that first time I ran it, I mean, that black sand was all the way down it. And uh, obviously plugged all the riffles up, and, and the second time there was a little less. This time here, even less. So, we're going to keep doing it. I'm going to keep doing it. I'm going to get every flake of gold out of that dig this weekend. And uh, we're going to see what we got. So... It's a good day to celebrate with some nugs. Gold Rush 21. Well, howdy hey. Welcome back to Gold Rush 21 birthday weekend cleanup. Well, let's see, this is the fourth run, I think. I don't know, fourth or fifth, doesn't matter. Way less sand. Even how much dirt I'm doing, I'm just using my pan to put it in there. But I think this is going to be my last last one with the keen. Um, I'll clean it out and 
take it to the gold room, but then I'm going to take what's left and pan it because, uh, well, I want to know if it worked. So while the gold wheel works, which does take time, you know, people tell me, oh, you can't get the Michael Dot Gold and the gold wheel. You're right, I couldn't at first. And, it, and you can't do it perfect. It's, uh, you know, beach sand, which is literally flies that are on flies poop, poop, small. Uh, yeah, that probably ain't going to do it. Uh, that's what I'm going to get uh, my blue bowl working on. I got to get a silicone mat for it. I'm going to take all my concentrates from this uh, gold wheel and uh, I'm going to use that on some rainy weekend. And uh, yeah, so gold wheel's doing its job. Definitely see gold in the cup. So we'll see. So I'm going to go ahead and let that flush for a little bit, maybe a minute or two, clean it out, bring it in here and add it to this, and then we're going to, I'm going to pan out the, the last of it and see if it missed anything. Probably did, again, you know, and even with this gold wheel, this gold wheel took me, shoot, lots, lots of tweaking and lots of tries to finally get it where I like it, and I like it where just a little bit of this just a tiny bit of this sand makes it to the cup in the back and if this little black heavy iron sand can make it in there then I know tiny flakes can and you guys have seen some of my cleanups some of them flakes are small but others are nugs I am excited I thought I saw a couple bigger flakes when I was doing this so even I haven't did anything more than what I showed you just basically look back here can't see it too well right now but you can see that there is black sand in there here I'll even shut it off for a second here just flip the switch you can see the gold in there but you can also see the black sand and that's why I do it that way I do it that way I still have to do a little bit of panning but I'd rather do that than to have gold spill out down there and then into my bucket Besides, I need every nug I can get. So, we're almost done here. We're on the home stretch. Gold Rush 21. Birthday dig. Howdy, hey. Welcome back to Gold Rush 21. Birthday dig cleanup. I just panned uh, the last... After that last run, I panned just to make sure. And... That's it. One, one, oh, there's another micro dot there. So, two micro dots. My landlord thinks I'm crazy talking to myself. Now you're on a video. I know it's an action camera, but I can't figure out how to, ah, never mind. So all I got left to do now is, uh, I'm going to pan these gravels, see if I missed anything, and keep that gold wheel running. So the keen worked. Cleaned up well, took a little work, but it was easy. So, we'll see what we got. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey. Well, I just dumped the cup, got everything ready to go. And uh, you can already see gold. But, it's time to find out what two days of casual digging uh, on this birthday birthday gold rush. Let's, uh, let's start the motion. Starting to show a couple good sized flakes in there. Some really small flakes, too. Well, I don't know what happened there. I started filming before and I was pulling this back quick just for a quick view, but this is my birthday weekend two days of casual digging and today of cleaning it up and we got i did pull some flakes down for some reason the camera 
shut off or I didn't push it or something. But anyway, I just did a quick pullback. And look at all that. Huh? Happy birthday to me. That there is pretty. And there's some good sized flakes in there. Some really fine micro dots. But, uh, yeah. People say that gold wheel won't catch that really fine stuff. And there's some fly poop in there. But, again, I, there's still gold down in this stuff. So, I am going to clean this up good. And, of course, take a, uh, just a picture of it. And, man, that's nice. I love seeing that. That's... You know, it's funny, you say saw that hole, how much dirt you actually move to get that little bit. But if I had to guess, and this is just a guess because I'm not going to weigh it yet, half a gram maybe, who knows, I'll know more when I get it completely cleaned out. But it was fun, I enjoyed myself, it was beautiful weather. That makes me happy. Happy birthday to me. That's some sippy cup action now. Gold Rush 21. Birthday big. Enjoy your night. That's freaking awesome. Gold Rush 21. Howdy, hey. Gold Rush 21. The birthday weekend dig final. And not bad at all it's uh, with the glare it's tough to get focus I thought maybe the dime would help huh my so much for thinking maybe if I turn this there we go yeah look at that everything from ultra fine micro dots to a couple really good looking nugs I'd have to say that's a successful weekend. I know I'm happy with it. Happy birthday to me, Gold Rush 21.